Well, Nintendo sues Power World. Yeah, you get me in the flesh today because this is an important thing going on right now. This is something that I alluded to much long ago on something that may happen against Power World. And it seems Nintendo has now taken those steps to sue Power World for a infringement on a patent right, not a copyright complaint, a patent right. Now, Nintendo's been very busy, under the radar, filing all these little patents over the last couple of years, it seems, especially since the creation of Power World. They're saying, okay, we're going to start putting these things out there, and we're going to start saying, we own this mechanic, we own this mechanic, we own this one, we own this one, and now they're attempting to block Power World from official release, it seems, because they're asking for an injunction and damages against Power World over a yet-determined awarded patent that Nintendo still doesn't have. Well, from the Nintendo website, filing lawsuit for infringing on patent rights against Pocket Pair Inc. Nintendo, together with the Pokemon Company, filed a patent infringement lawsuit in the Tokyo District. This is important because it's in Tokyo, not in the U.S. In Tokyo District Court against Pocket Pair on September 18th, 2024. This lawsuit seats an injunction against infringement and compensation on damages on the grounds that Power World, a game developed and released by the defendant infringes multiple patent rights. They're not just going after one, they're going after multiple. Nintendo will continue to take necessary action against infringement of its intellectual property rights, including Nintendo brand itself, to protect the intellectual property it has worked hard to establish over the years. So, Nintendo has made, this statement is very clear. They are saying it's over patent rights. However, their statement is also saying it's over IP. It's over intellectual property rights, which, if that was the case, the title should be over copyright, not patent. That is the first mistake here that Nintendo's making in this, in this lawsuit in Tokyo. That's going to be the saving grace right there is the fact that Nintendo makes this over intellectual rights and not over the patent rights that they are trying to go after. Now, what is the difference between the two? Well, copyright is more of the intellectual rights. So Pikachu, Ash, Bulbasaur, all the different types of Pokemon that are in there. But Power World, yes, they kind of are inspired by it. Maybe they're a diver derivative work or a parody of Pokemon, but then that's up to the courts to decide where that lies. Tokyo, by my understanding, also doesn't have a fair use doctrine, so it kind of creates another sort of layer at this point, but Nintendo has been busy filing many patents over this situation. So, thanks to uh, a few friends, um, patent assigned to the Pokemon company. So, as far as I know, these aren't awarded because they're only just kind of new. Well, this one's granted, I guess they are, and this one is an application. So there's one back at uh, in August 1st, 2022, which I believe predates Power World. Um, it was granted on the gamification and health awareness based on sleep patterns. This was the Pokemon Sleep app that came out. Um, and then in May 2nd, 2024, this is after Power World became a thing. A non-transitory computer-related storage medium having stored their in-game program game system, information processing apparatus, and information processing method. In an example of a game program, a ground-bounding target object or a airboarding target object is selected by a selection operation and a player character is caused to board the selected boarding target object if the player character aboard the airboarding target object object moves towards the ground, the player character is automatically changed into a state where the player character is above the ground boarding object bought into the state where the player character can move on the ground. This, I believe, this and the next one, the storage medium storing game program, game system, game apparition, and game processing method, in the first mode, I, I, 
An aiming direction in a virtual space is determined based on the second operation and a player character is caused to launch in the aiming direction an item that affects the field character does not disposed on the field in virtual space based on a third operation input. In the second input, the aiming direction is determined based on the second operation input and the player character is caused to launch in the aiming direction a fighting character that it fights based on the third operation input. These were both filed. One is May 2nd, 2024. The other one is May 2nd, 2024. They're ongoing. It's an application. These are not awarded to Nintendo yet. Now, the whole purpose of this is the Pokeball. This is something I alluded to that Nintendo may go after back with, this, with the spheres. This is something I alluded to back a long time ago in one of my videos. I, I've made several videos on Power World. Um, I said the, the Sphere is probably the closest thing Nintendo could go after. And lo and behold, this is where we're at. They're going after the Pokeball. They're going after the whole idea of throwing something in a virtual space that captures a target. And then it gets stored in a third party computer in that sense the same idea so the whole mechanic of capturing monsters is what it what they're going after now this has been alluded to like a pitch in a baseball game in a video game do you hit it does it happen to hit the ball do you hit it where do you hit the ball that's the whole purpose of this now they're also throwing in the whole idea that you have to have a fighting mechanic to make things weaker this is what they're going after. This is what Nintendo is saying is their patented right is, is an application. It is not officially their patented right. They must think that they're going to win this patent very, very soon. If Pocket Pair wants to do something here, at this point, I think they need to file injunction against these applications with Microsoft's backing. Remember, Microsoft picked up Pocket Pair's Power World and put it on Game Pass, meaning this is what... I alluded to this is giant news this means it's going to come down to nintendo versus microsoft in a court battle this is going to be an insane thing for video games in general there is so many more things that is going to come out of this it's going to set a precedent for a video game in particular, that you have a randomization of a video game. You have an RNG, the random number generation. You have a pitch. You have fighting monsters. You have so many other video games out there. Monster Hunter, maybe? Comes off the whole idea of Dragon Quest and many other games that came out before Pokemon. Pokemon just revolutionized the whole idea. And now Power World gives them guns and made it a completely different thing. They made it a survival world. They took the elements of many different games and put it together as one. So now Nintendo is trying to say the one idea of being able to capture Pokemon or pals in this case is ours. No one else can do that. And mm, I don't think that's a, a winnable offense at this point, especially considering they've filed this patent after pal world gain notoriety this is going to cause a lot of ripples in the video game world and is going to cause a lot of things a lot of people to step back and go what are you doing nintendo this is something i warned about this is if no one was paying attention to me back when i made those videos this is something i made allude to i it was something i said nintendo may go after them over the spheres I either said it in a live stream or in my videos because I know this is something I was talking about and lo and behold, that's where we are. I'm pretty sure that's going to be the one thing that Nintendo is trying to go after. And Nintendo is seeking damages and an injunction. They want to block Power World from official release. That's not going to happen. It's on Game Pass. It's under Microsoft's belt at this point. They have the funding of Microsoft. Microsoft is going to file against Nintendo and you're going to see the two big ones fight. And it's going to be absolute chaos when it comes to the video game world. This is probably one of the biggest news stories in video games in our lifetime right now. This is going to be big. Anyway, I'm your proud Canadian Phoenix Cinder Shadow. I'm signing off here. Have yourselves a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you again very soon.